notify users about the changes in Microsoft Lists using rules. If you want to notify your users about the changes done on the Microsoft List via email, rules is something that could help you to do that very easy way. You have four definitions when you want to notify a user about the changes done on the data or on the Microsoft List. If somebody will update the column, if the value in the column will be changed, if the new record will be added, or if the record will be deleted. This is the feature that probably in future will replace the old alerts, which you can know from classic SharePoint. And you will see that setup is very simple. You choosing the rule, you selecting who should be informed about the change. It could be the email address, could be the column that is present on the Microsoft list, like owner created by, modified by me, or email address which you will paste it. Let's select the owner. This rule could help you to be notified if somebody will start to delete data on your Microsoft list. If you want to be informed about the changes on the value, select the column, select the condition, and select the date, like today or specific date. And again, send who should be informed about that specific rule. You will see on the screen, you can manage existing rules and decide which rules should be actively used on this Microsoft list. Let's see how the notification will look like where somebody will delete the record on the Microsoft list. On your email box, you will receive that kind of information that somebody delete the record on the list and you will see the title of the record plus the link to the Microsoft list. Let's see how other notification could look like in case of the new record in case of the update and the conditional execution of the rule based on date, you also get the information about specific value that was changed by the user. As you can see, rules on Microsoft lists are very simple and useful feature, especially if you want to get additional notifications about the changes done on your data. If you would like to get more quick tips, more shorts around using Office 365, subscribe to the channel, left your thumbs up and see you soon in the next video.